In Clio 7, now it's possible to create lattices from a custom cell based in non b rep geometry. The custom cell can be solid, as in Clio 6, based on curves, different topologies of, of curves, or quilts. Very easy to use, just, just select the, the PRT file. This PRT file is propagated as usual. You can select the different uh, coordinate systems to define orientation. Different coordinate systems will result in different orientations than the distribution of the cell into the, uh, the body in this case. When you uh, select a, a user-defined cell based on curves, the result is a beam-based cell that can be solid or simplified. You can even remove the dangling beams, similar to uh, the, the, any other uh, functionality related to lattices. Here, um, I'm reducing the uh, ball diameter in order to make it more visible. Okay, so if we change the orientation, the result is is being different based on the uh, uh, different propagation pattern. If we select uh, another type of curve-based cell, also full geometry is possible, even density variation as well is supported. The last example is based on quilts. When you have a quilt in the, uh, in the user-defined cell, the result in the lattice is a solid geometry. Uh, we are thickening the, uh, the quilt. Here the example that we are seeing on the screen is again the different propagation scenarios based on different coordinate systems. Now we have a faster and cleaner definition of custom cell lattices.